Joji. So today is Sunday guys. So we've been um, experiencing difficulties around the world. Um, so yung coronavirus na yan, yung COVID-19. So, so naisipan kong i-share sa inyo na since nasa bahay lang tayo ngayon, home quarantine, so naisipan kong gumawa nito yung fruits na pampalakas ng ating resistensya, immune system. So habang nasa bahay tayo, yun na lang yung munang gagawin natin, yung palakasin ang immune system para hindi mahawaan agad ng sakit. Kasi pag healthy tayo guys, um, mas ano tayo, mas may mas advantage sa atin na hindi tayo basta-basta mahawaan ng anumang klaseng sakit tulad ng mga simpleng sakit like sipon or ubo or lagnat. So lalo pa ngayon na epidemic yung nangyayari ngayon sa atin sa buong mundo. So let's start guys. So i-share ko rin sa inyo kung anong mga benefits ng bawat isa. So I have here a grapes an apple, a banana, a melon, a papaya, and a mango. So, let's start. So, let's start with the grapes. So, ito na guys. Itong grapes na to may help protect against cancer, eye problems, so cardiovascular disease, and other health conditions. So, it is a good source of fiber, potassium, and a range of vitamins and minerals. So, grapes. Mm. So guys, the next one is papaya. So, kainin natin tong papaya. So, yung papaya guys, lowers cholesterol. And helps in weight loss. So, sa mga gustong magpapapaya dyan. Boost your immuni um, immunity. Good for diabetic also. Um, great for your eyes. So, protect against arthritis. Improves digestion. Mm. Um, it also helps ease menstrual pain. Pag nagmimens tayo, masakit yung puson. So, pwede pala tong papaya. And prevents uh, skin, aging, yung mabilis yung pagkalubot ng ating balat. So, para magiging glowy always at makapag-prevent na mabilis ang pagkalubot. So, you can eat papaya. Tapos, it prevents cancer. And it helps reduce stress. So, pag stress ka, bumili ka na lang ito or... Manguha sa, kung meron kayong tanim sa paligid nyo ng papaya, so pwede nang kumuha doon at pag-stress o upo at kain, relax, o ganyan lang. Mm. So guys, ito yung ano pala ng papaya. So, nakaka-healthy din to sa ating balat. At lalo na ngayon, pag-stress tayo, so kain lang pala ng papaya. So let's proceed this one, a melon. So it speeds wounds and muscle healing and it supports immune system and a, a good source of vitamin C, regulates blood sugar, great for heart health. Mm, lowers blood pressure. So, pwede ito sa mga high blood. Mm, antioxidants. Good for the skin. Low calories and 
full of fiber. So, pag medyo matigas na yung uh, constipated tayo, so you can eat this para mag-soften yung uh, natin and good for digestion. So, ito yung melon na to. Mm. And now, let's proceed to uh, an apple. So, okay, this one, apple. So, common to sa ating lahat. And, ano din to siya, guys. Helps improve bowel mov movement. Um, helps to prevent cancer then. So, helps in digestion. Um, helps treat anemia. Kung anemic ka, pwede pala itong apple. So, helps fight weakness. So, para palakasin ang ating buong katawan. And helps control in diabetes. Pag diabetic ka, so pwede itong apple. And it's beneficial on the skin. So, magiging glowing ating skin. So, sa mga hilig na magpapakanda dyan, so pwede itong apple every day. And reduces blood pressure on blood vessels. So, okay, apple. Mm. And the next one is mango. Or you can pronounce it as mango. Mango. Oh, so, pwede yon Kahit ano. So, ang benefits nito, guys, uh, it's still great for your skin. So, halos lahat, or lahat naman ng ano, fruits, it's good for the skin. So, kahit hindi ka na mag-vitamins for the skin, basta may fruits ka lang complete every day. So, pwede na to. So, another thing is good for your eyes, for your eye vision, na maging normal. So, lalo na tayo ngayon na medyo hindi maiwasan magbabad ng konti sa cellphone. So, pwede to siya. Good for your eyesight. Um, lowers your cholesterol level. So, pag medyo mas masyadong napadami yung kain ang taba natin, so pwede tayong kumain ng mangga. So, it's rich in minerals and remove acne. So, naka, nagpapaprevent pala ito ng ano, acne pimple. So, para hindi magkaka-acne pimple ang ating face. So, pwede palang kumain itong mangga. And it fights also dandruff. Oh, and helps in diabetes. So, matamis tong mangga na to guys. Pero it doesn't mean na helps in diabetes. So, kain ka lang ng kain. So, may limit din. So, as we all know na too much of something is bad enough. So, itong lahat ng fruits na ito, yung tama, yung tama lang talaga. Hindi naman yung masyadong madami. Mm. And then... Ang benefits pa ng mangga guys is nag um, fights ag against heart diseases and cancer. So, it also boosts sex drive. <laughs> okay? And now, punta naman tayo sa banana. So, banana. So, itong banana guys increased energy. Totoo to. Kahit ito lang yung kainin mo para mapalakas na talaga para hindi ka weak. So, it improves digestion, um, cures all ulcer, skin conditions, cures heartburn. So, increased, um, it has vi uh, vitamin B6, rich in potassium. So, ito po yung banana. Hmm. Yung bananas in pajamas. Diba? So guys, 
Ano ko lang sa inyo na eating a lot of fruits and vegetables makes us beautiful. So, magiging healthy, beautiful, and glowing skin. So, ang daming benefits sa pagkain natin ng fruits at saka yung vegetables na rin. So, ugaliin po natin na kahit yung mga ano lang, mga simpleng prutas na andyan lang sa bakura natin. So, kailangan kakain at kakain talaga tayo ng prutas. Yung iba hindi mahilig sa prutas, pero ako mahilig talaga sa prutas. So, kailangan kahit isa nito merong available o kahit hindi man natin maano, maaraw-araw at least uh, makatake tayo ng prutas kahit two times a week. Pwede na din yun, di ba? At least may ano talaga sa ating katawan. Um, fruits intake. So guys, that's all for today. I hope may natutunan kayo sa aking video, sa aking episode today. It's all about fruits, mukbang, and with all the benefits na sa while kumakain tayo nito sa ating uh, pang-araw-araw na pagkain na dapat may prutas talaga at lalo na sa vegetables. So, kung ano kayo, new to my channel, please don't forget to subscribe, like, share, and pakicomment na rin um, kung ano yung mga um, idea nyo about sa pagkain ng prutas. Although, may mga ibang patients or na at the age of mga 60 up, so may mga bawal na prutas na dapat kainin. So, bago kumain ito, please consult muna sa doktor kasi tulad nitong ano, may allergy sa banana or sa mangga o ganun, I haven't heard it. Pero may nagsasabi na ganun na allergy sila sa mga may ibang prutas na allergy sila. So, bago kumain ito, pero kailangan mo na kumonsulta sa ating expert. And that's all for today. Bye-bye! See you next time!